a lot. So uh, this time out, we won. <laughs> yeah, it was an incredible game, man. I've never seen it. I don't know if I've ever seen anything like that. Yeah, I mean, uh, 46 points, career high on 19 shots. That's like, I don't even know what to say, man. Jeremy, how much of an effect did seeing Chandler coming back on the court, you know, have on you guys? Make it's huge because he's a stabilizer. He's a glue guy. Um, we need him in the game. Uh, just everything he does, all the little things that he does on top of it. He's score, pass, rebound. Uh, he's just a huge, huge part of our team. So uh, to have him come out, he's going to tough it out. Um, it meant a lot to everybody. He got the crowd going as well. Jeremy, uh, did you skip, uh, tonight's game remind you of you know, the insanity time last season in New York? That kind of feeling of bad shots at a crunch time? Uh, you know, I'm just uh, out there having fun, man. I'm starting, I'm, I want to write a new chapter in my life, you know. I, I, you know, I'm thankful for and everything that happened, but, um, you know, we're moving forward now, and, and I want to be able to you know, write new new things and, and not always, uh, you know, I just want to write new pages in the book, so. Without Tony, uh, do you think if your role has changed very much, you needed to play more and to shoot more? Um, yeah, I mean, Tony was a huge, uh, huge asset for us. He came off the bench and, and just scored, uh, scored efficiently, scored very quickly. Um, he averaged nine points in probably, you know, I don't know how many minutes he played a game, 20 minutes or something, and, and that's something that we're gonna, you know, we're gonna have to be able to get, uh, get from other people. How tough is it when you find out shortly before the game you guys gonna be short handed? Yeah, that was just pretty much the worst thing. Um, it sucks because like uh, we, we, we're a close knit team and we actually really really care about everybody that got shipped off and uh, it was just really emotional for me. I mean, I to be honest, I was like, I don't even want to play. I don't want to play tonight. Um, yeah, it was really emotional. Um, and so I wish them the best, and uh, it just it just sucks to see them go. And I guess that's part of the business, but that's uh, that's, that's a tough part for me. So in the end, when you guys pulled off the win, came back like that, and to overcome adversity like that, how much did it mean even more getting the uh, I mean, it means a lot to get a win, but to be honest, uh, it doesn't mean it's, it hurts. Like it's bittersweet. Uh, tonight is definitely gonna be bittersweet. And, uh, we had, uh, <laughs> you know, well, we shipped off four guys, and, and uh, you know they're all big part of our team, and, and uh, I'm gonna miss playing with them guys. So uh, but, yeah, I mean, I'm happy we won, but it really just sucks to be honest. Talk about the feeling, you know, you guys are down 14, seven minutes left in the game, then you come back, you hear the crowd. You know, what's that feeling like? In the game? Man, the crowd was amazing tonight. Um, I've never seen a crowd like that in my entire time. For the year that I've been here, I've never seen the crowd go that crazy. And so, uh, definitely a huge shout out to them. Man. They were our six man tonight. You guys made the first ten three points. Probably not the number you guys. It's not often to see that. Was it something that you guys saw you could expose in the defense? Well, we just felt like we needed to move the ball and move the ball um, quickly and, and uh, get it to the weak side and. Uh, you know, that's what ends up happening. When you move the ball the right way that fast, you're going to end up with a lot of corner threes, a lot of open side threes, so we're able to exploit that. 